And would it serve you to have a 30 day container where like, no joke, you manifest and, and Laura, I, I, I don't know if I can put you on the spot, but I'd love to, Laura went through the last 30 days. I'd love to hear what surprised you in the process. What like kind of came out of left field. So first of all, it's the best, uh, 30 minutes of your day. Um, and also cause you get to be with like other people and you, it's, it's always good to remember you're not alone. Um, and to have like your accountability partners is amazing. Um, but yeah, I, so right before that I had set this intention that I, and I don't remember the why, like, why did I need $10,000? But I did for something. And so I had just set this and then I think I was like, maybe like 10 days into it and it had shown up like that ten thousand quickly yeah. yeah quickly very quickly but then what was really great is one thing that she had me do was like get uncomfortable with something that i was really uncomfortable with and that has always been like just randomly like giving money to people <laughs> so i had just earned from a client like a hundred dollar bill in cash they just gave me cash and i was like uh holding on to it and i almost gave it to my son but then i stopped myself and then it was like no coincidence the coincidence the next day when during the program amber j made me do like some outrageous thing and i was like fine you know what i'm just gonna give my son this money for no reason whatsoever like i'm just literally just gonna hand it to him and it was so triggering and uncomfortable for me to give somebody money for no reason <laughs> I'm like, oh, it just made me feel horrible, icky. And I knew it was something I had to work through. Like, there's no reason for that. Like, you should give money freely and be happy about it. And I was just like, it's just for you. Like, you know, I was going to give it to you yesterday, but like, just keep it, spend it, whatever you want to do with it. And then I think it was like the next day that um, out of nowhere, $25,000 showed up in my bank account. <laughs> it was just like, what? Yeah. I'm just like, that's insane. Uh, yeah. So it was pretty cool. And it, what I always say is like, it was always there waiting for us. The, the finances, the abundance is there waiting for us. We just have to get into that vibration of allowing. And I feel like there's just a lot of um, work that needs to be done inside our mind and especially in our subconscious mind that will allow that to show up. So that's where it, it totally helped me allow the money rather than me always being in like fear of not having it. And the doing, like you didn't have to do anything for that to show up. Yeah, right? I mean, like I don't do a lot anymore. I've really spent the letting money, you know, flow to me, trying mm -hmm. to prove that what spirit always says, which is that you don't have to hustle as much. And, I, and it is true. Like for as much hustling as I did the last few years, I barely made any money. And then I shifted into like less doing and more being, and then I like tripled my money. So <laughs> it really is about that. And that is, that is the muscle we're working, right? They say it takes 30 days to make a habit. That's why we sit in this 30 day container.